or phase C to phase A. And the other three ones are related to ground loops or L1G or phase A to ground. So it is very good practice to change the voltage and current values and distance real like parameters to learn the concept and the parameters deeply. Now let's enter the line parameter in distance real block and add zoom 1 with 80% of the line length and zoom 2 with 120% of the line length. Let's change the fault location and load the simulation result and see how the impedance trajectory will be changed based on the different fault locations. After the relay setting, we can analyze the relay performance visually and understand different parameters. Here we can see different zones in the relay. We can select each zone and check the type. As mentioned in the x session, if any parameter have formula. Here we can see different zones are available for ground faults and phase fault. And if we check them, and also if we select PT connected to the bus bar, then we will see there will be voltage in the post fault type. Yes, here we can see the PT after breaker. And if we select at bus bar, there will be here we can see the impedance function or NC 21G and it has two zones. Zone 1, the operation of the phase to take time and it may we have some mistakes. If we check the loss of excitation parameters in the relay, 